hi guys welcome back to my channel this is your girl all things shannon welcome back my old subscribers and welcome my new subscribers today i'm here to share with you how i made my delicious shrimp and grits and if you're not subscribed to the channel what are you waiting for hit that subscribe button like the video share with your family and friends and leave a comment and don't forget to hit that post notification bell it will let you know each time i post a video and you can also follow me on instagram and tiktok at all things shannon let's get cooking Let's get started on the grits. Just follow the directions on the back of the box. I'm adding water. And what I like to do is I like to add just a little bit of chicken broth. This is going to give your grits that extra flavor. So now I'm adding in the chicken broth. Now I'm adding one tablespoon of butter. Let this come to a boil. To my boiling water, I'm adding a little bit of kosher salt. Now I'm adding the grits. Let your grits cook for about 15 minutes on low heat until it thickens. This is how the grits is looking so far. I'm adding one tablespoon of butter. Stir until all those lumps are out. As you can see, the grits is starting to get creamy. I don't like my grits hard and I don't like it too loose. I like my grits to have just a little bit of firmness to it. Now that the butter is all melted, I'm adding just a little bit of cream. This is going to give it their rich, creamy texture. If you don't have cream, you can also use milk. The grits is pretty much done. I'm gonna turn this up a notch and I'm adding cheese. And I'm using triple cheese and that consists of Vermont cheddar, sharp cheddar, and mild cheddar cheese. This is how your cheese should look, nice and creamy. I cannot wait to eat, it looks so good. Now that the grits is all done, let's get started on the shrimp. I already have my shrimp clean and deveined. Now I'm seasoning with Creole seasoning, garlic and onion powder, smoked paprika, cayenne pepper and Old Bay is going to bring out that seafood flavor in parsley.
mix all together. To my pan I added avocado oil, now I'm adding the shrimp. Let these cook for about 2 minutes on each side until they turn pink. I'm just turning them over on the other side so they can cook another two minutes on the other side. The shrimps are all done. I'm going to take these out and set aside until it's time to use. In the same pan, I'm adding onions. I'm adding one tablespoon of minced garlic. Let this get soft. The onions and the garlic is all soft. Now I'm adding two tablespoons of flour. This is going to be the thickening for the sauce. Now I'm adding cream. Using the back of my spoon, I'm breaking up the flour and vegetables.
Now you want to season your sauce. Don't add too much seasoning because the shrimp is already seasoned. And I'm adding Creole seasoning, garlic and onion powder, cayenne pepper for just a little bit of heat, and parsley for color. I have my fire set on low heat. Let this simmer until the sauce thickens. As the sauce continue to cook, I'm adding the shrimp. Let this simmer for about two to three more minutes and then it'll be done. Okay guys, there you have it. This is how my shrimp and grits turn out. I hope you guys try out this recipe. You won't be disappointed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and today. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, share with your family and friends, and leave a comment. Don't forget to hit that post notification bell. It will let you know each time I post a video. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok at all things Shannon. Until next time. Bye guys. But I don't wanna play your fair. Yeah, something.